Okay, so someone was asking me how you set up the page so that you can um, print on the label maker, the Epson C65. You want to set the page to whatever size label it's going to be. So you come over here and you set it up to whatever size it is. It's two and a half inch circle, one and a half inch circle, whatever. You set it up to the appropriate size. And then I always like to put, since I do like round circles, I like to put a little guide so that I know if the image is all going to be within that circle. So I just put that over the top of the page. And it's not going to print that red line, but it gives you an idea. It acts like a guide. And that's usually just a cut line. And then once you have that scaled to the exact size, you just want to go and open up and merge in whatever image you're going to use. All right, go ahead and merge in the image. This is for a little candle uh, container. And then I set it up for a print bleed since it's printing all the way to the edge. And I only do just a little bit. You don't need to have it bleeding out too much. You're going to get ink everywhere. And that's it. Um, you set it up to print with the Epson label maker. You have to actually set it to that printer because it's going to be usually on whatever other default printer you had it to. And it doesn't take to the settings right away, so you have to cancel it out and then go back in. Once you go back in, then everything should be set. You look at the preview, and if the preview doesn't look right, it's not going to print right. That print, If the preview looks wrong, you got to go back in and redo it. And then you should be set to go. And that's it. Good luck. Let me know if you have anything else I can help with.